Welcome back to another video. Now, Aruto wasn't a guy that I was excited for at all. I mean, like, yeah, sure, he looks cool and all, but even though I'm not excited for this guy at all, there's people who are very excited for this man, very happy that they got him. And one of that being one of my buddies. This dude barely even plays Genshin Impact, or before he barely played Genshin Impact. Aruto releases, he's back on the game, and he drops an entire bag on this guy. I'm, I'm confused. How do you just come back to a game? is just like yeah i'm gonna see six a character i've known this guy for over 10 years and some of the things he do still doesn't make any sense to me what is this Damn. now i have not seen his damage output yet he tried so many times to get this weapon to r5 but instead he got this weapon to r4 i don't know what kind of new level of insanity you have to be to just go back to a game and just decide to drop an entire bag and he's probably gonna do the same thing for your lawn too he says now then before i obviously continue on i'm gonna have to need bennett's all actually what can i do with Without Bennett. Yo, what the fuck? Why am I hitting 41k? There was a vaporize. Okay. I'm not gonna even drop all my alts on you. What the hell did I just witness? <laughs> Now, listen, C6 Ayato, I consider that pretty goddamn broken. Not gonna lie. I consider C6 Ayato really broke. C0 Ayato is balanced. He doesn't really deal crazy damage. 10k per slash seems pretty balanced. Well, you're starting to do in between 30 to 40k per slash with how fast this man can attack. That's quite a bit of damage. It just doesn't make any sense. This thing feels more brainless than Gan Yu. This is actually wild. Like, this genuinely feels like people be talking about how boring Gan Yu gameplay is. If they're okay with Ayato gameplay, then I don't know. <laughs> Maybe it was worth it to come back just to drop a bag on Ayato. Maybe he knew exactly what he was doing. But let's look at this build. So here's his HP flower, feather, sands of time, cup, and helmet. He has really good artifacts. The sub stats on all those artifacts are extremely good. How fast will this pyro cube actually die? <laughs> Get the fuck out of my park! What? What? What just happened? Why did he disappear so fast? I just slashed like two times and he died. I'm actually genuinely confused. On to my next test subject. Whoa. Let's try this now. No, he moved out the way. I'm sad. Doc, I can even kill it in one go. I didn't even use food buffs either just now. I actually killed it with something besides Raiden Shogun. That's actually wild. You see, this is the only boss that I can trust when it comes to being able to take hits. I feel like anything else that I use with food buffs will just die immediately. But I have to say, this is definitely one of the most cracked things I've ever seen in my life. Can you really call that shit balance? Because I sure as hell can't. What are you aiming at, Ayato? Oh my god. I just missed all those slashes, but I still just took so much of his HP. Are you kidding me? See, this this stuff here is what's considered broken, especially at what AR? This is the type of stuff that's considered broken at AR 50 and above. All these other people's Ayatos that people would be saying, oh man, my Ayato is so broken at C0. It's not. Trust me, buddy. If your Ayato can be doing the same thing this Ayato can be doing and other C6 Ayatos can be doing, then yeah, sure, your Ayato is broken. But at C0, I don't feel like that dude's broken. It's just balanced. Hitting in between 7 to 10k per slash isn't really that crazy and the fact that this man is hitting wildly without buffs it, he's still hitting stupid numbers oh. like you can't sit here and tell me that that's balanced with how fast he's actually just attacking for old times sake i'll even visit these four ruin guards over here morning nigga detected Oh, 
To be honest, if somebody said this was the Gan Yu of sword users, I wouldn't even complain. Well, if he's C6. To be honest, I don't know. I feel like Ayato C6 is more broken than Gan Yu C6. Personally. I don't know if it's actually like, you know, calculated true or false, but at least the damage output is just faster. It doesn't matter what I do here. He literally just kills them. Even when I'm not critting, I'm still dealing so much goddamn damage. It's not even funny. It's like, what exactly can I actually do here? What am I supposed to do? Everything just dies so fast. Hey there, Fox. What am I supposed to do with something so powerful? What is there that challenged me inside of this game? What what exactly do I fight here? Somebody like you deserves to be hit in the street by a fucking moving bus. Thank you, Fox. I really appreciate it. This character's actually too broken at C6. Not even Ganyu makes me feel this numb. When I'm just using Ayato at C6, I just feel so god awfully numb, it's not even funny. It's like, no matter what I do, no matter what I fight inside of the game, I'm just gonna be sitting here winning. It's like, there is no such thing as a challenge. Even Abyss, I'm sure, is just quite literally free. So do you see it? It's like, if I just all, okay. See you. <laughs> like, there's genuinely nothing I can do. No matter what I fight, I'm just going to win. I'm not gonna, there's no point in even playing the game anymore. This is why I don't think that every single character, you know, should be broken inside of the game. And I'm happy that it's only C6 that's this busted. Something about Ayato just makes me feel like he's a little bit more simpler at C6. But again, that's just personally me. Of course, everyone else is gonna have a different opinion. If you enjoyed the video, leave a like. And if you did it, take your anger out on the like button and sub button. See you next time. Peace.